انفجار 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 Well, what, what they did was they took, uh, they took a 30, 30 centimeter piece of time fuse, cut it, and uh, ignited it, and then they'll time it so that they can calculate how long it takes for that 30 centimeter piece of time fuse to burn through. Once they have that, then they will uh, determine how long it, you know, th their safe separation time, how, how long they need, whether it's two minutes, three minutes, um, you know, wh whatever, they, whatever they feel safe. Well, this uh, is a one-month-long course, so they uh, this will teach them how to deal with explosives right on site. It allows them to blow things in place. So they've uh, they're aware of the hazards with IEDs or with a uh, live ordinance that that failed to go off, and so right now they are 
putting together their final shots and uh, actually setting them up on real devices, uh, in this case ordnance. Uh, I think it's fantastic progress, especially with the instructors, because not only are the students confident with handling explosives, but we have the instructors that are very confident in teaching them and maintaining control while they're working with potentially sensitive explosives. Really just uh, putting the knowledgeable and, uh, and very confident soldiers in these leadership positions where they can further develop, you know, because this knowledge that we pass on to them in one course can be spread out throughout their, throughout their personnel by themselves, you know, so then we slowly back up and then give them more time to teach themselves and then it just um, propagates itself, you know what I mean?